So I'm playing The War Will Win, a traditional turn-based combat game using your deck of cards to deploy both your men and your strategic structures. I'm playing the free demo here so you can play it yourself and see if you want to support the Kickstarter and all that. So this is a deck builder, so you'll have to work out what combination of structure cards and military units you prefer. Um, and don't forget your builders to actually build the structures. What I'm going to do is, first of all, choose, let's see, make sure that we've got some arch, plenty of archers. One, two, three. I think I'll get three knights, who are a good sort of middle ground, fairly strong. Now we'll have one cavalry, which is a new, a, a new unit I've just been given, which is very expensive, costs five energy. And we'll have a couple of builders as well, so we can actually get some structures built. So that's the units, and structure-wise, uh, we'll have a couple of walls, one, two, and some farms, which give us extra energy at the start of every turn. Right, I need, a, I need one more thing. Well, I haven't actually used a fortress card yet, so let's try that. Anyway, level three is what we're playing, so jump straight in. This is much less amusing than it was last time. Even if you manage to stop me here, it won't change anything. Why don't you just go home to your castle where you're safe from all the scary monsters and demons? It suits you much better. I could never go back empty-handed, especially after what you've done. Right, so we have five energy to spend and we'll get two back at the start of every turn. But we can make things better using farms. First of all, we have to deploy our commander. And then, ooh, let's see what we've got. A couple of archers, good. And, oh, a farm, already a farm. Right, so unfortunately we haven't got a builder, so we can't actually build that farm or that wall. So, since we've got five energy, I think I shall stick to making as an archer and uh, hide him in the woods. And that's all I'm going to do this turn, because I can't build the farm. Right, enemy, attack! Got plenty of sword lads, and two archers. All I have to do is kill the king in this case, or the enemy, who's got eight health. Right, we've got a builder, excellent stuff, so I'm going to deploy you. And I'm also going to make that farm just there. And that's my turn. And now these lads um, um, have gone off their first turn, I can actually move them. Um, I might actually move him up there. I don't think I can attack with him just yet. I don't think he's... No, that guy is just out of range. So, we won't bother with that. We'll end the turn, see what he does. Unfortunately, he's got a lot of lads coming at me. Ooh, he's getting a bit close. So we do need some melee units quite soon, I think. Ooh. But now, look, I've got three energy back instead of two, so that means things are going to get a little nicer. I can afford an ar another archer, actually. Let's do that. Uh, I think we're going to stick to arching for the time being. Boop! Oh, hang on. We may want... Oh, God. I could send my commander in to tonk you. Um, it's a bit of a risk, but I think I might do it. Might as well get rid. So I'm going to probably take a, a couple of lumps here. Oh, God, he's summoning more lads. Ooh, ouch. But thankfully, the terrain is a bit tough for them, so... So there. Okay, so one energy from there. Um, we still can't get a knight involved, which is what my preferable thing. So, I think I'm going to do a tactical retreat. Meanwhile, you can be shooting you. You can be shooting you. Good. Right, so the builders, so can't, we can't really do much else. and There's no point in making more builders, because we've already got one. And we've got that. I would like to make it to the farm, but first of all, I'd like to get a knight. So with any luck, next time we should have six energy. We're going to get overrun quite soon. But they can't attack in that turn, so the archers are getting closer though, which is a bit alarming. And so, what I'm going to do is move them back a little bit. Shoot. And shoot. Now he's a knight, so he's still got a little bit of tastiness in him. So I think that archer is probably going to die. But we've got six energy now. And we could definitely afford a knight, which I'm going to place a bit further back so he doesn't get attacked this turn. Um, and I'll save the two energy, I think. Ooh. Thankfully, there's only one knight. We are, we are going to st um, start building up our empire soon enough. No, especially now we've got this farm sorted. That's going to help a lot. But yes, bye-bye archer. Those archers are going to start getting in, in range soon, but they don't seem to be going too close. And what have we got now? We've got five energy. Oh, we could have a cavalry. I think they move very fast. Um, or oh, knights. Knights are a lot healthier, but they don't move as far. I still can't afford a fortress yet, but I don't really know what they do. And what I could do is move my builder and then place a wall there. We can attack through it, uh, but let's not do that. We'll have to actually move the builder. So let's let's make, let's try. Let's give this a go. Aha! <laughs> Behold my wall. Uh, we've only got one energy now, so I think it's time to shoot you. Can I move you any further? No, you can only move once a turn. And now we've got ourselves a knight, though. 
So he, he can move. And what I'll probably do is put him down... Put him down there so he can maybe move next turn. Aha! Wall! Aha! You shot the wall. You had to shoot the wall, didn't you? Uh-oh. I didn't see him. Oh, the wall's gone. I didn't actually realise he was actually an enemy. <laughs> Wasn't paying nearly enough attention there. Hang on. Um, let's just give him a quick tonk there. And we could definitely do with another knight. I really shouldn't have sent that knight in down there, should I? Um, let's put you in there. Let's shoot. Get rid of you. And the archers, I say, are getting worryingly close now. You're stuck there, aren't you? So, yes, we are going to take some lumps from the archers. Now, the archers don't have much health, so... Oh my god. Ow! So we are, I mean, this is, we're not doing this very efficiently, but we have, it's a sort of game where you actually have to build things up and then you'll probably get strong and be able to take everyone on. Um, makes sense to have a new archer. You can get moving. Right, okay, so what we're going to do here... Unfortunately, I'm not going to be able to move very far because of situations, but let's, let's get stuck into you. You can move to there. And nothing else we can do. I just need to... I really just want to get rid of that archer now. They are slowly building up... Oh my god, I really need to get my commander into safety, don't I? And I'm still not really getting... What I could do with this is another farm, just so we can really get moving. But for now, we have double archer. Um, I could get rid of the archer straight off, so let's do that. And then you can kill you, and that should get rid of you as well. Oh no, hang on. I do need to move you in. Missed. And Tonk, you. Right, okay, so nobody's close to us. And they've only got a couple of knights coming in. Uh, need We need to build up some energy, so let's hope for... Let's see what we get with our next hand. Hmm. Got another archer. I think so. We can move one of these lads a bit... F let's actually start um, pushing our advantage a little bit. Not that we've got a huge advantage, but... Can't quite reach them. But that's okay. That's okay. That's not too bad. Um, again, the builder can just stay there. I haven't quite decided what I'm going to do with my building yet. I think the farm... It would be nice to actually get to the farm, as I say, but... Not really getting much use here, so... It looks like we're just going to have to... Shoot you. Shoot you. And shoot you. I desperately need some melee units. Ooh. Get in there. And tonk. And also, I'm going to have to bring my commander in again. And really, normally I keep my commander well back, but in this case, pushing our advantage just seemed to be more helpful. And we've got some energy in hand, so this should give us some good stuff. Now, we're from a Fortress. That's got eight health. But I did say I needed melee units, so I'm going to do that. As you can see, because of my commanders moving further forwards, I'm able to deploy my lads a bit further forwards as well. Um, I could get another builder involved. Let's, let's in fact, try to get our builder a bit further forwards. Hang on, you can get shot. Also move you to there, and you can shoot. You're stuck in there, so you're not going to be able to do much, so I think I'll move you to there. You might be able to get him from there. There we go. Um, everyone but... Okay, my, my commander, I'm going to probably stay stay there. What's that? Never actually used that. <laughs> Not quite sure what did, what that does, but... Hey-ho. Right, okay, so he... Well, he's got he's got an attack um, left over, but he hasn't got any movement, so... End turn. But we've, we've whittled him down to just him now. Apart from that new lad that just turned up. But let's get you. Since you're not in trees, I mean, you can, get, you can really push forwards now. You to there. That's, that's my commander, which is, again, probably less than ideal, but let's form a little ring of steel around him. Now, I really want to try out this fortress, but by the looks of it, it's probably going to be unnecessary. Don't really think I need that, do I? Okay, let's see what happens. Let's really see what happens now. I mean, we are probably going to win at this po Ow. You could have actually killed me. Um, retreat. <laughs> um... Let's just see what happens with this fortress. I'm intrigued. It's eight of eight, so maybe it's maybe it's just. Is it defensive or not? I don't know. Anyway, you stay there. I think at this point we are probably about to just absolutely murder him. 
should take care of him. Yes. The other guy dies. Will you away again? You make me sick, coward. I lived another day, so don't worry. I'm sure I'll get around to killing you sooner or later. He's having a great, great time, that Zephyr, isn't he? Jolly old lad. If you live long enough, that is. I take it back. Oh, it's a magic cards. Okay, so we can add this to our deck. Deal three damage and the light and and the light of the affected tile on fire. And like okay, right. A royal draft two times. Summon a copy of all pawns on the board up to a total of ten pawns. Well, I don't have any pawns in my deck at the moment because I took them all out. <laughs> so we have a look. So we could Well, let's have a look at the magic cards. So we've got a few of these. We've got one fireball. Oh, no, we've got a few fireballs. Um, I'm guessing that can only be cast by my commander, though. I'm not really using walls, so let's maybe get fireballs involved. Um, my archer strategy seems to be okay. Uh, cavalry, I don't think I'm going to be using that. And because I'm not using pawns, as I say, I'm probably not going to bother with that. Um, we've got three farms in the deck. That's quite a lot. But we don't seem to be going too defensively at the moment, so let's go for... There's loads of cavalry. I can't have another archer or knight, can I? I think I will keep the cavalry in my deck. And let's go for one more battle in this video. See what's what. Oh wow, they've got they've got knights or horses. Some, oh no, it's just, it's just some just some crappy. Oh hello, leave me. This is my battle. I will protect these people. Wait a minute, you're Sergeant Oscar. Yes, I thought your order had vanished. We were ambushed by the enemy. I will fight to prevent them, no matter the cost. Some may call that bravery, but I find it closer to stupidity. If I fall here today, let the king know I died in battle for my country. Are you even listening to me? Oh, who, who are you? <laughs> God damn it, there's many of them people. I doubt you can even remember my name if you try. But if you must try and cram it into your pathetic little mind, it is the High Priestess Libera. Now let us begin, you are wasting my precious time. So I'll only do a few turns of this battle, just to give you a flavour of what happens with magic cards. Right, so we've got a choice of using either of these two, so I'm going to try this instead, just out of interest. Uh, okay, so let's, um, well, we haven't got any building at the moment, so let's go... We could just... Hmm... No, let's get a knight straight off, because, frankly... Well, they've got, they've got, um, cavalry, and they've also got, I think they're, I think they're magic ranged lads, so we've got to be careful about those. But nothing else we can do with this turn. God, they're gonna they're gonna make mincemeat of us to start with the thing, especially if they're gonna go that fast. Already we've been tonked. We we've actually got less health, but we if you notice our attack is is bigger than the other lad. Um, anyway, we can easily we can easily sort you out straight off. But now we have three energy, so now we can build our goddamn farm. But we can also we've also got that fireball. So, what I might do is go there, and if it works the way I think, we should just be able to do TONK! Crispy horse. Delicious flesh. Right, okay, we've killed the horses, we've got a farm up and running, and we've only got those magical lads who are quite far away at the moment, so that should sort us out a little bit. Okay, I did see we were, we said we only have a few turns here, but I also could point out we can discover all the various um, attacks just by right-clicking on them. So we know exactly what's going on. And there's me. A heroic soldiers is always the first to charge the enemy and all that. Um, I do I do warn you now that um, I think the, the um, I've found that this level in particular is a bit unstable and can crash out on you. So hence why we're only doing a quick look at this. Yeah, check out the Kickstarter if you're interested. Well, thanks for watching. Do subscribe to Randomized User to be notified when new stuff goes live about all the latest and best new indie games out there. Uh, and I'll see you next time. Bye for now.